Welcome to the support videos for workload automation video series. In this video, I will show you how to configure Control M server to perform a shout automatically to kill a long running job. I will be using Control M version 8 on a Windows machine for this demonstration. On the Control M server, go to command prompt Enter CTMSYS, select option number one, which is shout destination table, select option number one, create and modify table, select system as the default by pressing enter and press Y. Here you will see a list of shout destination tables defined. In this demonstration, I have pre-configured the shout destination as follows. Destination as program, address type as server, logical name as kill job, physical location as C script kill job dot bad. Make sure you include the full directory path and the file name of the script. In this example, I have created the killjob.bat script on the ControlM server under C script directory. And here is the content of the killjob.bat. In order to simulate a long running job, I have created an OS job with the sleep command 400. Next, go to the action tab. Click on the plus sign icon besides the notification before job completion. For simplicity's sake, I have pre-configured the notification before job completion. In this example, I have selected when job execution time is greater than one minute, destination field, kill job. In the message field, type the message percent percent order ID only, which will become the parameter for the kill job dot bat script. Important note, do not insert any other string into the message field, else the shout will not work. Next, select the desired urgency level. Click OK. Then order the job. Select yes to confirm and select order. Go to monitoring domain. After the one minute elapsed time of the sleep 400 command, you should see shout to kill job perform and the job ended not okay. That concludes this Control M solution video. Please see our knowledge base and YouTube channel for more videos like this.